We've learned time for ammunition. Total casualties of war. 45,962. And that's Slay Elves. Let's hit Slay Undead. General, uh, General, kill them all, Edmund strikes again. I actually think he would be most pleased with that little nickname. Grants him a certain level of badassery to him. Right to bear arms? Revoked! Populous power as if emperor, emperor turns dictatorial! Isn't an emperor by its very nature dictatorial? Hmm. Please, journalist. I'll need to have a word with them again. No rest for the wicked! Emperor disagrees! Yes, well, it has been a quiet weekend of consolidating power. Speaking of uh, power, let's have some words at the bar. Still haven't abolished booze, I see. I appreciate her condition as much as the next elf, but her life is not worth others' deaths. I'm sorry, but that is where I stand on the matter, and I'm not the only one. Mm -hmm. What Commander, is this about, I then? must protest. If what Trinculo describes in those shockingly callous terms of his is true, the experimenting that is going on on behalf of Lady Ophelia is unacceptable. Oh? I will have to have word. Trinculo, what crude words would you describe <laughs> this as? Is that you, Commander? Forgive me, I'm still wiping the tears from my eyes. I cried with laughter. I did indeed. You should have seen those orcs. One sip of Bungle Brew's grog and they melted like snowmen exposed to a hundred suns. Well, that's Squish. not a very good cure, <laughs> is it? I expect res better results than this, Trinculo. Bastora. I don't know if you've talked to Oberon yet, Commander. But if you haven't, please do, for I share his concerns to the fullest. Hmm. Yes, I have. Well... Com... Commander? What? Hmm. Well, that's the solution that Undead Lady has, I suppose. What uh, is Ophelia up to? We need to have words. Ophelia, oh, what is wrong? Oh, my heart and soul. How I have prayed for your swift return. Thank Never you. should I have allowed desperation to trump circumspection. I am entirely to blame for what has happened. I'm the sorry. Seven bless us. One might as well apply magma to alleviate sunburn. Your words are beautiful, but they confuse me, my dear. Speak plainly. The wretched orcs, forced to partake in the drinking of what they presumed was tea, drank instead the heartless herald of decay. Before my very eyes, they began to bleed from every orifice. Ooh. Became ghouls and snared in untellable agony, until mere puddles of putrid matter bore witness to their horrid demise. Okay, so we will not try that again. And yet their souls remain. What? Hovering helplessly upon capricious currents like ephemeral jewels evoked from stardust. That sounds Therefore, lovely. My love, if you allow for a moment a selfish turn of thought, know these souls may spell my salvation. Please don't tell me you're going to eat them. I have been told that by means of magic or machinery, Ooh. they may be given refuge in a new dwelling, be it made of meat or metal. The prospect is eminently exciting, for I too might benefit from one such transference and come to inhabit a body void of disease. What do you say, my earth and sky? What do you say? Shall we put these orcish souls to the test? Hmm. That's a hard thought. Hmm. The weight of magic would require a human sacrifice to succeed. No, let's the imps make some metal thing as the answer for now. No more death need to be uh, caused on our court. For my love with you will remain regardless of your skeletal body. Though I have come to dread the ramifications induced by impish machinations, I must concede to your wishes when confronted with your will and wisdom. Wisdom indeed. I am glad you agree, my dear. You are as wise as you are beautiful. So, uh, well then, 
that matter sorted. Uh, well, I suppose we should invest a bit. No, actually, what we should do is invest in our armies more. I think we will uh, enhance explosives. It's lovely, but I think we need to uh, have some control of the seas. Work on the juggernauts for now. And while we're at it, the skies may also be filled with fighters. Excellent. Right. On to our warfare. So you see, we have sadly consolidated ourselves in the north, uh, in the northern lands. Still, I'm troubled by this build-up uh, right next to my borders. I think we'll need a navy to deal with that more thoroughly. Um, let's actually merge this. Uh, can't I merge this? I guess I can merge this transport fleet. Okay, I'll just leave them here. Go. Yes, I think the transport will need some kind of escort. So my thought is to uh, invest in at least at least one juggernaut for now. Excellent. And why have I not retaken this land? Do my bombers not count for that? Well, I suppose they'll provide the escort that I need then. Yes, we need this source of uh, wealth. Badly so. Can you actually fly? I wonder. Yes, you can. I prefer you actually go here. Is this good? Yes, I think this is good. And let's get one transport out there. Please. Down here, yes. And let's go back to the normal voice. Bring them to invade here. Hopefully we can take it next turn then. So it'll be a solid boost to our economy. Now, I think over here... Can we make any? No, we don't have the wealth of anything. Okay, then I guess we'll save up. Well, turn done. Nothing much more to do then. Set our invasion over there. Yes. If we get some juggernauts out there, we can uh, probably blast all those transport boats they got on the way. Ah, moving to Hammerdale and claiming it. Clever. I think green is the biggest threat we're facing. So, yes, there is a big battle over here, but... Uh, it's one easily won, I think. Hmm, well, we have eight gold. I suppose we can hire a general for, uh, for a change. Everyone costs eight. Very well then. Scarlet is not good for this. Catherine is a naval specialist, is she? Yes, let's uh, have Catherine handle this. No curses! Why did they have to take the transport? Curse it all! We want that wartime edition! Casualties of war! A bloody transport has carried all our troops and now we can't invade anymore! 
And otherwise it's almost the same. Souls fused with machines. Cybernetic revolt only a matter of time. Our man aboard the Raven. Many wonder if the Emperor can keep it up. I can certainly keep it up. I will, I will show Ophelia later how well I can keep it up. Is the Emperor one part of a twin? No. How do you, could you get such ridiculous... I thought we curbed false uh, reporting, but apparently not. Our Queen has rewarded us with 500, start the battle with 500 recruits. And we can sabotage bomber balloons. Edmund, Catherine, are you here about the latest victory? You know I don't hold a high opinion of men in general, Commander. Yes, but that Henry was very does off, go please. out of his way to reaffirm what some would call my prejudices. I'm glad Scarlet saw the light and kicked him out of her bed. Even a girl as frivolous as her can do infinitely better. Hmm. Well, I agree, but uh, that's no reason to keep that uh, against Henry. Edmund, what are you doing oh, here? Henry, how his vagaries amuse me. A woman that rejects him must therefore not be interested in men, so goes his logic. As if one can blame any woman romanced by that buffoon to abstain from men forever. Well, well that is a wrong conclusion indeed. It's more clear than Catherine. I'm surprised that Edmund proves enlightening here. Let's find Henry at the bar. Yes, of course. Why am I not surprised? Henry, what's the matter? What the hell is the matter with Scarlet? Here we're having some extracurricular horizontal recreation, and suddenly she bails on me. I tell you, she must have knocked her head against the door and started liking girls all of a sudden. No woman denies herself my affections from one moment to the next. Well, you should speak with Ophelia. I'm pretty sure she would deny you most heartily. Where is Scarlet, actually? the royal chambers, perhaps. Oh yes, here she is. It's rare to find anyone that comes here. Please do not look into the portal too much. Damn that loudmouth, Henry. I'll emasculate him with a pair of pincers if he doesn't hold his tongue. We've been having a bit of fun, you know, casual-like. But uh, now I told him that the fun's over, he's telling everyone I must be into girls all of a sudden because that's the only explanation for rejecting a true blue man like him. Filthy pig. Hmm, yes indeed, I agree How on that. How dare he? How? But... Oh, Fudge, what's the use? Why would I stand here and pretend to fool the dragon, the ruler of worlds? Yes, why would Never you? Never have I said this to anyone, Commander. But it is true. I am a lesbian. There. The die has been cast. Well, good on you then. I would not mess with Henry any more than if I were you. When I was 16, you see, I first fell in love with another girl. But... When my parents found out, they were furious. Threatened to disown me and sent me to military school. Do they I need vowed to eat that your if parents? I'd show any sign of being attracted to another girl ever again, they'd never more show me kindness or affection. What wretched people. That is the secret I've lived with ever since. I force myself to sleep with men, but it is all a farce. A hollow way of ever so shallowly satisfying hidden, unacknowledged needs. I was forced to live a life of lies and believe me, I can handle it, but I can't bear to have my real nature dangled in front of me as a means of mockery. Well, it is a sad uh, story indeed. I'll have word with Henry not to bother you again. And I do hope you will find plenty of happiness in other ways. Also, if you need your parents to be disintegrated, I can arrange for that as well. Thank you, Commander. To have your support means a great deal to me. More than you can imagine. Perhaps one day I'll be free. Free to be who I am. We'll see. Indeed. Henry? We need to have some discreet words. What the words. hell is the matter with Scarlet? Oh, I guess we'll have that off screen then. Fine, fine. Now let's see, what should we... Uh, we can buy a very nice dragon power, perhaps. And we have units. Aura of Annihilation. See, I'd like a passive power, if at all possible. 
Eye of the Patriarch. So I have trouble de deploying those uh, powers. I need a bit of practice with that, I fear. Devastation! Oh yes, we're taking this. More damage is good. Activation, no. Uh, I guess we'll close this and put some uh, buy some nice thing at engineering then. Expert. Hmm. Muscle gas. Hunter. Oh, rocket bots. Yes, I like this. There we go. All spent. On to more battle. Hopefully Ophelia is doing well. So then. Um, yes, well, we are close. I'm guessing we can take over. No. Okay, then what we'll do is we'll, we'll just keep guard here and send another transport over. Also, we'll buy another juggernaut. No, that's not what I wanted. I say we'll buy another juggernaut. I guess we'll need some uh, more of these, I guess. We'll take... We technically only need one soldier to make it across, so... Uh, hello, let's put you down here. Hello, map, would you please respond? There we go. Keeping our troops over here. What? Well, I think I'll actually fly this to... Because I don't think we'll see much resistance here. So I'm thinking maybe we'll move... Uh, honestly, maybe we could smash some of these transports. That might be a fine idea. And then move them here. All of them. Hmm. Anything more? No. I think it's uh, time to turn the die uh, or the dial again. Let's see how transports do against an army of bomber balloons. Probably none too well. Aha! An invasion! Fight it off! Let's do this! So we have two fronts, I imagine. That's this one, which is... Uh, Heavily in our favor. They do have juggernauts. I'm impressed with that. We have only three gold, so I guess the Imperial Navy. So we we'll probably need to defend our island. So let the Imperial Army deal with this. A solid advantage. Only one loss. Yeah, these bomber balloons are way overpowered. And their naval force is wiped. Very good. Now this we will need some personal interference with to uh, handle the battle. I think I will deploy also some cards. Mm, we have hunters here. Let's see, do we have anything for hunters? Enemy hunters range. Let's get some troopers. Or should I add more hunters? More hunters. Ironclads. Ah, 
I think we'll, uh... Hmm, are they if, uh, what are they bad at? I don't quite know. So I think some troopers will be handy here to keep things secure. That'll... Oh, wow, we can almost just not do it then. You know what? I'm saving these. We can do this. Ready! So, we uh, are going to add a lot of uh, passive powers here. Friends with benefits. Don't need that. Devastation. I don't know what that other power was, but it's probably not important. Passive, passive, passive. I want all these passives behind each other. Right, then we can remove these. And what should we add? Uh, inspire? Yes, inspire, damn you! Friends with benefits. Purifying flame and advanced. Advanced. We got everything right. Yeah, I think we do. Yeah. Oh, crikey then. Ready for battle. Alrighty then, uh... You set the trap, I'll make the kill. Shit, you're blowing my cover! Think. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee! Now those big cannons are very slow, so... Construction underway, Commander. I suppose I should actually save these. Uh... You found me, did you? Without a trace. Oh, they are moving over there with troops. Okay then. Actually, let's pull Picking back. Let's pull seat. them all back. Capture that point. Completed. Right. Move on here. I don't want these riddle buggers to get this. Hopefully we can turn dragon quick enough to deal with these cannons. I suppose I'll get one of these in. Progress. Yeah, they are going to siege, I see. You found me, did Damn it, they got the to the point. Troopers now. You're blowing my cover. Let's reclaim this point. Oh well, it'll be a while before their seating is really that effective. And then we can go dragon and uh, smash their heads in. No, it's a trap! No, it's not. You found me, did you? Right, smash the troops. Okay, get close. Uh oh, they are getting too close to my liking. Fuck your artillery, biatch! Base under attack. It seems to be I do not like this. Oh, you still live! I'm impressed. 
And I think then we will need to consolidate our power a bit. Um, get a new battle forge going. Like the wind. And please conquer this little point. Will be built in a jiffy. Construction in progress. You're blowing the cover. I hunt for your glory. Smash these bloody grenadiers. It will be built in a jiffy. Without a trace. Good. Uh, we should have a solid resource. Construction in progress. I should be getting a solid resource and uh, advantage soon. Mortar turret completed. Your unit will roll out momentarily, Commander. Bunch of troopers. Nice mountains. Trooper awaiting your instructions, Commander. Trooper ready to march. Well, seems I set the forest a bit on fire. That's a nice detail. To fight. Trooper ready to march. Heavy metal dragon. Yes, I like it. Construction mm, underway, yeah, Commander. And this one we need more recruits, Commander. Construction in progress. Could make another. Uh... Let's get this dance of death started. They Let's tell start me moving into there. Have been issued with imp binoculars. I think we can start moving into their territory. They are sorely under completed. You set the trap. I'll make the kill. Oh, they have a lot of things there, but now it won't much longer. Capture this remaining little base. Catch us, catch, catch. Please capture that building facility. I'll do this one. Excellent. Now just, yeah, surrender. Very good. All too easy. Yeah, they just did not uh, produ uh, produce me. Good, nothing lost. Well, I'll let these uh, battles I'm not involved in run and then... Uh, Return to you in the next episode. Good day.